Hey everyone, what's happening? This is Ivan. Give me a place to stand and I shall move the earth, the famous Archimedes said when he discovered the law of the lever. Remarkably, Giulio Perigi, the author of this painting, depicted earth in blue as it is visible from space. And that painting is dated back to 1599. Anyway, according to Plutarch, Archimedes, however, in writing to King Hero, whose friend and near relation he was, had stated that given the force, any given weight might be moved, and even boasted, we are told, relying on the strength of demonstration, that if there were another earth, by going into it, he could remove this. Archimedes knew that there were no such weight that couldn't be lifted with the smallest force, you would only need a long enough lever. For example, a person weighing 60 kilograms would need a 3.4 kilometer long lever to lift the Statue of Liberty. To lift the Earth, however, which weighs around 6 billion trillion tons, you would need a 10 to the power of 20 kilometers or 10 million light years long lever. Now, how much time would it take? When Earth travels 1 centimeter, around half an inch, the other end of the lever travels a million trillion kilometers. Suppose Archimedes could generate 1 horsepower at the other end which is roughly equivalent to lifting 60 kilograms by 1 meter in 1 second. It would then take him 30,000 billion years of work. Suppose now that Archimedes can move the other end of the lever at the highest speed possible, the speed of light. Even then he would still need around 100,000 years. If Archimedes devoted his whole life to this, he wouldn't leave the earth even by the thickness of human hair. As the golden rule of mechanics dictates, whatever you gain in power, you lose in displacement and consequently in time. I hope you found something new from this legend and if you do, please give a like and subscribe. Until next time, stay curious.